Marcus Spears. Uh, listen, uh, Bruce Aarons just got done talking. We'll talk to you in a second. You could rest your eyes a little bit more. Let's bring in first Jeff Darlington, of course, who broke the story with Adam Schefter a month ago about Brady's retirement. You spoke to Aarons yesterday. What can you tell? What can you tell us about the conversation and uh, a potential Brady return? Well, first of all, the Bucks are not naive. When you hear them saying that the door is open for Tom, they're not naive to the fact that it is very unlikely. Arians told me exactly that. We talked for a while about it. I talked to Jason Light about it for a while as well. You know, they've got Blaine Gabbert. They believe in him. But we have to remember, like, as Arians told me, there's not, like, some crazy quarterback market out there. And a lot of these guys that are big names, like a Russell Wilson, for instance, is going to require a ton of trade compensation. So if Tom Brady in a few months – gets the itch to come back, which, by the way, let me be very clear, that is not the case right now at all. But if that were to happen, yeah, they would entertain it. Of course they would. But let's just all settle down and relax because it is very <laughs> unlikely you, at this point. Thank you. And talking to Arians and talking to Light, they do know that as well. Uh, well, Marcus, you, uh, you, <laughs> we'll continue. You, you can continue your prayers. <laughs> let's just bring in Mike T here on this idea, this concept that if, if Tom Brady wants to return – but it isn't a Buccaneer. As a GM, how would you handle it? I wouldn't want him to go anyplace else. And about a decade ago, I dealt with something very similar with Brett Favre. We had just hired Rex Ryan. We knew we wanted to go young. So we drafted Mark Sanchez. We knew Brett wanted to go to the NFC. So that made it a little bit more like we could live with it. It wasn't perfect by any stretch. And to Coach Arians' point, why would I let Tom Brady go someplace else, exactly. specifically like a team like the 49ers, who we're competing against? So it is bad business. I would try to recruit him. They're not going to get anybody even close to him. we got to remember, he had one of his best seasons last year, despite his age. So I agree with, with Coach Arians. It would be bad business to let him go anyplace else. Okay. Marcus Spears. I, I'm going to just ask you this, okay? Where will Tom Brady be in August? <laughs> on a boat. On a damn boat. <laughs> He'll be on a boat. He'll be watching us on Get Up talk about if he coming back to the league, laughing with Giselle and, and, and negotiating with his group to determine what franchise they want to be a owners, owners of. That's mm. what he's going to be doing. I get it. I love the wishful thinking. We hate to let, we hate to let the goats go. We knew MJ wasn't MJ when he was playing um, with the Wizards, but we wanted to see it anyway. And he still could play good every once in a while. We don't want to see him leave. We ain't want to see Wayne Gretzky leave hockey. We see none of that stuff happen. Tom Brady is retired. He is going to be on a boat. Listen, y'all, I'm going to tell y'all. I didn't have nowhere near, I think, I'm, you know, stating the obvious, the career that Tom Brady had. But I'll tell you this, that first training camp, when I was able to turn on ESPN and see how y'all make it look all good and all the players are so happy to be there and nobody is hurting, they want to do interviews, everybody is prevalent. I was sitting at home getting my tackle ready to go fishing at Lake Louisville in Texas and thinking to myself, this is the greatest day of my life, even including draft day. Tom Brady will be on a boat. Like I said a few weeks ago in the Mediterranean Sea with Giselle, he'll be fielding phone calls about Denver Broncos' ownership, <laughs> if he could be a part of that group. Um, Derek Jeter just left the, Mar the, the, the Miami team. He might want to buy that. Those are the type <laughs> of things Tom Brady will be doing like when you. football season start. It's fun to talk about. I love you, Jeff, but I'm right. I don't want to hear it. Let me just tell you something. <laughs> Let me just tell you something. I'm going to give you one sentence here, okay? Whether Tom Brady okay. plays football again or not, he is not leaving the state of Florida. Mm. Okay? You come down to Florida, you don't leave. Listen to that, okay? okay. You don't leave. I'm a Florida guy. You. you know what it feels like for me to come to Indianapolis? <laughs> if he plays football again or not, he is not leaving the state of Florida. Put all that San Francisco stuff aside, okay? Just put it aside. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.